Hey, what's up, hip hop fam? Welcome back to The Queen Reads. Today I've got some wild updates on Diddy that you won't believe. You know how courtroom drama can get intense? Well, this one's straight out of a movie script. So, Diddy's been in the clink, right? And during a recent raid of his prison cell, federal investigators snagged a bunch of his personal notes. We're talking 19 pages, people. His defense team is crying foul, saying this raid was a complete overreach and violated Diddy's constitutional rights. Attorney Mark Agnafilo, who's been repping Diddy, dropped some serious accusations in court. He claimed that the feds were just fishing for reasons to mess with Diddy. Among the seized papers was Diddy's things to do list, which shockingly included a note to a family member to find dirt on two alleged victims. Yeah, you heard that right. Now this whole situation has thrown a wrench into the case. Agnifilo's arguing that this raid could lead to the dismissal of the indictment, or at least the recusal of the prosecution team. The judge ordered all copies of the seized papers to be deleted for now. But wait, there's more. Diddy's not just sitting back. He's accused of trying to obstruct the case from behind bars. Prosecutors say he's been paying off witnesses and using his children in a PR campaign to sway public opinion. They even claim he tried to influence potential jurors by having his kids post a birthday video for him. And if that's not enough, Diddy allegedly called and texted one witness 128 times in just four days. Sidebar. One of Puffy's infamous videos of Meek Mill's 27th birthday party has mysteriously surfaced. Yep. Meek Mills, who is now distancing himself from anything Diddy, and who has went so far to say, no Diddy gang, Meek Millie in real life, don't ever disrespect me, you heard? This was just on November 12th, on a viral vid he did in Philly. Let's just say he's singing a different tune in this B-Day vid, all buddy-buddy with Diddy in French. The guest even ate sushi off a naked model's body. Talk about creepy vibes. And now we know where Kanye got it from, at least Puffy didn't have his kids there, or did he? But I digress. Plus, he's accused of using other inmates' phone accounts to dodge the authorities. This man's got moves even behind bars. It's a tangled mess, and Diddy's fate is still hanging in the balance. His next court appearance, a bail hearing, is set for Friday. Will he walk free or continue to fight from the inside? Stay tuned for more updates. If you want to keep up with all the latest in hip hop news, make sure to hit that subscribe button and ring the bell. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.